Hey, what's up guys? Good morning. Hope you guys are doing well. It's another day, another day in the life. Mowing grass, cutting that grass, making that cash. What do we say now? Anyway, uh, it's actually mulch bed prep day. So let me show you guys really quick. Nice, dude. Good job. Looking good, bud, looking good. All right, so what we're doing today is we are prepping all of our beds. Next couple days, we're gonna be doing all of our mulch installation. Normally, when we do a property like this, like 25 to 30 yards, we're always spending one or two hours just, you know, bed prepping, bed edging, removing some of the excess mulch around some of these trees. Like, for example, I'll show you really quick. This ring right here was another three plus inches high. And so we don't want to create those mulch volcanoes as a lot of you guys always point out. And also Caleb Wallman's always talking about. This is another bed that we just cleaned up. For us, we actually have the dump insert full and then we'll take that, dump that, get rid of it. So that's kind of the idea today. Um, super windy out. I don't know if that's translating through here. You guys can see the uh, flag right back there. It's blowing like crazy. It was blowing a lot crazier just about 10, 20 minutes ago. Uh, it's freaking cold. So tomorrow we're gonna take off because it's gonna be like 30 degrees out. Friday we'll be back out in about so today, doing all the mulch, bed prep, and just kind of getting the uh, the sites looking good. That way when we do all of our mulch next week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, hopefully Wednesday doesn't rain, but Monday, Tuesday, we can just come in here, drop the mulch, sling mulch, and rock and roll, right? Redneck approach, we bucket it up, right? And then we're bagging it up, boom. So that's what we got going on, let's keep it going. Oh, by the way, uh, everybody always asks, what do we use? This is the Steel Combi 131R. Love this thing. Let's see if I can do this really quick. Uh, I like it a lot. If you guys have the uh, Combi 131R, let me know. Leave me some comments. How do you guys like yours? Ours is almost uh, four seasons old now, and uh, it works like a charm. So any of the beds that we have all the way around the property here, uh, our machine shop, our tire shop, uh, our HOAs, we're gonna be using this thing. That's what we do to clean out all the beds. and. We always charge an extra dollar, dollar fifty per linear square foot for bed edging, bed uh, prep, if you will. Not bed prep, but bed edging. Uh, but let me know, do you guys use the Combi 131? Do you guys use a spade or a flat shovel to get those crisp edges? Love to hear your guys' thoughts. And uh, oh, hey, by the way, not to do a plug, just want to make resources available for you. But for the month of April, our mulch installation training program, 20% off with promo code MULCH20. So for some of you guys that are just learning the business and want to uh, learn how to do mulch, there you go. We got uh, launchpreneuracademy.com. I'll leave that in the description, but you doing good? All right, I gotta get back to work here, guys. Start button always helps. Combi, we go around the bed, we get that squared off look, hard rake, pull it back, get that invisible edge all the way down. So it just kind of cascades into the grass. Um, not every year do we have to rake all this off. It's just been about two years and we're noticing we're getting those uh, mulch volcanoes we were just talking about. So we're just taking all this out. Like I said, the dump is full of other leaves and debris and material. We got to actually use that later for a video at the end of the week. I'm huffing and puffing, bro. We're getting back to landscaping work. Yeah, I know. Guess who pulled landscaping duty? <laughs> You know, all right. Oh, thanks. Well, this was a transplant tree that we did last year. We won't have to really work on that one too much. We'll take it mulch out of there. The last two, we're gonna remove a little bit of mulch from those, and then uh, bed edge all this stuff. Super simple day, man. Feels good to be out here working.
so far. Looking good. All right. Alright guys, so just got done dropping Rob off. We are all done for the day. Uh, we just got back from Spurt, which is our local dump, and we were able to drop off the, the bags of mulch that we took out of there. We had four or five bags. We dumped uh, all this like tall you know, grass that we were pruning down. We uh, also uh, dumped off a bunch of sticks. We had uh, one cleanup that we had crazy amount of sticks from a backyard, had like two huge oak trees and over winter, those just get bristled around and you know, a bunch of bunch of sticks and twigs fall. A lot of cleanup there. It's all just hand picking it up, a bunch of little manual labor stuff, right? Um, and you know, this is actually a fun day for me because I'm, I'm always learning. I, I don't have it all figured out, but I will tell you this. Uh, I learned from Kelfus last year to sometimes take an extra day to do your your landscaping uh, bed prep, your landscaping, uh, just kind of take a day to prep and take a day to get your job ready. And I was like, dude, normally we do all this stuff the same day. And it's an interesting point because, let's see, it's we started at 9.30 in the morning when we finally got out there. 9.30 till about 2.30, 2.45, so it's a good, 10 30 11 30 12 30 1 30 2 30 so what is that five hours times two guys that's 10 hours that we would normally 10 labor hours involved i mean we were working that's 10 hours that we would normally have into these two different jobs where normally we show up on the mulch day to do that there was days when i remember last year or two doing sherwin for example we wouldn't even start slinging mulch till 10 30 11 o'clock in the morning now we normally have three or four guys that were, were doing those jobs but still now we have that 10 or 11 hours already out of the way and so when we go do mulch next week monday tuesday wednesday uh, we can just literally show up start slinging mulch the beds are prepped and uh they're looking good so i, I learned that from kelpas last year we did that uh landscaping video I'll, maybe i'll leave a card here or whatever uh, i can do here or an end screen for that bed prep video that landscaping bed um, maintenance video that we did last year with kelpas that was really helpful for me just hanging out with him in person um so anyway i'm always learning i'm always growing always trying to uh make our properties look a little bit better and uh this year my goal is to just take our time do it right um not be in such a rush 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 like usually we're not uh this early into the season right usually um we are a week out from mowing and we got to get aerations done mowing done uh mulch done all all this stuff and it's just like it just gets kind of um you get choked out and so then you start rushing and things don't look as good and you're like dude i just got to get the job done right so anyway that's what we're uh got going on today uh, we're gonna take tomorrow thursday off not sure when you guys are watching this but thursday it's gonna be like a high of 34 real feels like 27s all day I, i'm not doing it um opt out i got a bunch of office work and a bunch of calls i can make and uh work i can do and then friday we're going to uh shoot some more videos for youtube we got some other exciting things coming for you guys i think you'll like those videos next week which is why when we went to the dump we didn't dump all the leaves out so what, any guesses on that one any ideas what are we keeping all of our leaves for we're gonna do a little uh little leaf video leaf video so it'll be a fun one i think those videos should drop next week but all right well guys that's what i got for you today um i hope you guys are really appreciating the uh, the daily content all the vlogs lately i've been getting like 700 to a thousand likes which is freaking crazy i was thinking about i was running the idea around like if every video for the week i'm doing monday through friday content every uh, every night at 6 p.m doing daily vlogs for you guys if every video for the week gets over like a thousand likes all five videos i think i'm gonna like do like a weekly giveaway or something like that so if you guys keep the momentum growing on the channel the algorithm will respond with views views uh mean makes a couple bucks and with that money let's just give it back let's give some stuff away so that's that's what i'm thinking so let's try to get this video over a thousand likes and uh super appreciate the support as always all right well we'll button up right here uh if you guys haven't hit that big thumbs up appreciate it uh if you guys are new here maybe you've watched the video or two before and you haven't subscribed yet hey 
this is the algorithm letting you guys know that you might enjoy the rest of our content so maybe hit subscribe uh it's all about lawn care and landscaping on this channel and uh taking you guys down the journey of running my lawn and landscape business so all right guys well whatever you guys are watching this hope you have a great rest of the day great rest of the week and we'll catch up with you guys here on the next one